When I tell a family that their newborn has a birth defect affecting their digestive system and will require a surgery, it always comes as a shock. Some children are born with complex problems in their bottom area. Two of these problems are called anorectal malformation and Hirschsprung's disease. An anorectal malformation means that a child might not have a normal opening for stool to come out, or might just have one opening for both stool and urine. In Hirschsprung's disease, although the anatomy looks normal, there's a special kind of nerve missing in the bowel that is meant to help stool come out. Children born with these conditions require specialized long-term care. As they get older, problems that may have been difficult to detect before potty training can become evident, such as soiling or incontinence. By the time they have started school, this has a tremendous impact on their lives. For children, it can mean not going to a sleepover because they wear a diaper or not going swimming because they're scared of having an accident. I'd like to introduce you to George and his mom, Kelly. They're a family we've been following for years at the Children's. Due to my colectal pain, I was not able to go to school and I wasn't sleeping enough, which didn't help my growth, neither did my lack of food that I'd be eating due to me staying in bed. The pain was really bad. It was about seven or eight, I would say, on most days and I was always in and out of the hospitals. It does put stress on the family, meaning like me, I couldn't work. They had to be here caring for George, and obviously the other parent had to always work. School was really hard too, because I would miss out a ton of it, and it only got better this year. Recently, we had to accompany George to the U.S. so he can get a specialized intervention that we did not offer here in Canada. And I was shocked to hear that we don't even have a center a colorectal uh, center for children. So I believe it's very important for families like us to have this access. Uh, this center would provide resources, care, avoid waiting times in the emergency. It would help parents like me just pick up the phone and talk to a nurse or doctor directly and get you know, the answers quicker. For these families, it's a constant struggle to maintain dignity, but there's a way to help. In the US, colorectal centers of excellence have transformed care. These centers allow families to meet a hyper-specialized teams of doctors and allied health professionals who are experts in treating children with colorectal problems. Treatments offered may range from a tailored bowel management program to physiotherapy or, in some cases, a complex reconstructive surgery. In any case, the goal remains the same, to put an end to accidents and the shame that often comes with it. We're not out of the woods. George needs a center. All other children or parents that suffer, suffer every day, have pain every day, and don't know where to go. Help us get these kids the treatment and care they need. It's nice that after this entire operation happened, the disorder went away fully. I eat everything now. Mostly putsin, though. And we're Greek origin, eh? Not a Slovakian, a putsin. <laughs> There's no reason why we can't offer this kind of expertise. The children need your support. Together, we can help children reclaim their lives and enjoy a future shaped by their dreams and not by a disorder. We can do that right here in Montreal. Thank you so much for putting your trust in us.